This is the IFF TV podcast. It's Irish Football Fan TV here with Tom Cannon of the Ireland Under 21s. So, Tom, we'll start off on a personal note. You've had a really good season so far for Preston. How are you finding it? Yeah, enjoying it. It's going really well. Um, obviously, you know, scoring like you know last couple of games and uh, playing well, so I'm enjoying it. And how have you found the championship? Obviously, it's notoriously a very physical league. What have you found it like since you since you joined? Yeah, it is. It's an uh, it's a tough league. Um, I say from being there now, basically every point there is crucial. Um, like you're not going into like you know an easy game. Like every game's a tough game against you know a tough opposition. So it's important that like you know you just keep ticking away with points and hopefully uh, seeing where it takes you towards the end of the season. And obviously. Everton is is your parent club. Are you keeping an eye on their results, and are you hoping to go back there and kind of push into the team at the end of the season for yeah, next season? Yeah, um, keeping an eye from afar, like because obviously, you know, I'm at Preston, so I'm going to be focused at Preston. But um, I'm seeing the results, and um, you know, uh, obviously new managers come in and they're, they're um, picking up points, aren't they? So it's good, and then hopefully. From my point of view, is just do do as much as I can at Preston. Do, you know, do well, play well. Um, hopefully, keep scoring, and then obviously, hopefully, take that back to me with me in the summer. And obviously, then touching back to twenty ones. Um, this is a really kind of fresh squad with thirteen players that have never been capped before. How have you found it as a group and the kind of atmosphere in the camp? What's it been like? Yeah, it's been good. Obviously, um, a lot of new players, so everyone's kind of you know just getting to know each other. Um, and uh, all seems to be getting on very well and then obviously you know the focus then turns to uh, Sunday for the game and Jim's obviously been doing really well with Ireland in the last few years uh, and he's signed on now until 2025 how has he been in training and what have you thought of him as a manager in comparison to managers you've had at club level yeah he's a good manager um, good man manager as well I've spoken to him you know previous to, for me to come in, come in the camp I had a couple of phone calls with him um, and He's uh, he's good. I enjoy working with him, and um, yeah, training's been good so far. And obviously, you're with twenty ones now. But Stephen Kenny, the, the first team manager, he's shown that you know if you perform really well, even at a young age, he is willing to put players in the team and kind of blood the young players. Is that something that gives you hope? And um, when you look at other lads like Evan Ferguson or Will Smallbone who've moved from the twenty ones into the first team, yeah, it is yeah, of course. Um, obviously, you want to be playing the best football you can, and hopefully, if um. All I can do is just keep my head down, keep doing what I'm doing, and then, you know, if the chance comes for a senior call up, a call up, then obviously I'll be there. And then, with last year, obviously the twenty ones had a really good campaign. Do you feel like the goal now is to kind of push on and in this campaign to actually qualify for the tournament? Yeah, it is. Yeah, obviously, um, obviously, as you say before, new players, so it's obviously it's a it's it's a, it's a fresh slate if you like, you know. Um, all the lads gonna go and get to know each other, you know, and then sure we'll you know give it a good go. And then obviously there's a lot of players now, which is something you wouldn't have seen before in Irish football moving abroad, like the likes of Festi, um, James Abanqua, and other players who've moved to Italy. Um, and then you've obviously got Jacob Bryan in Belgium. What do you think of that as a kind of pathway rather than the usual playing in the League of Ireland or playing in England and trying to move up the leagues? Yeah. Um... I think it's a good pathway to be fair. Obviously, obviously I've spoken to Fe- Festy, you know, whilst he's been here, you know, about what, you know, how he's finding it and stuff, and he's enjoying it. So um, it's a good pathway, and you only have to look at the likes of, you know, Jaden, your Jaden Sancho's and your Jude Bellingham's going there, and then showing what they can do to then, hopefully, you know, obviously come back to the Premier League. And then lastly, just in terms of um, your kind of position and your role in the team, is there anything Jim has asked from you? Um, Particularly in your role, if you if you're going to be playing in the next in this game, no, he hasn't asked uh, nothing yet. Really, obviously, it's still early days into the camp, so I'm sure as the week goes on, um, we'll have like chats. But he's obviously just trying to focus on you know how he wants to play, you know, and like meetings and stuff. But on a personal level, it's nothing. He hasn't told me nothing really. No, Tom, thank you. Cheers, thank you. Cheers.